Welcome to Film on TV. I'm Janice Dickinson, and we are live. My fabulous guest is April today. April is a phenomenal woman who does a lot of stuff for the Academy Awards. April, too. Uh, April. Say hello to your uh, followers out there. Hello, followers. Hope you guys okay. are doing well. Okay. You can call in at three. In, you, you can you can call us uh, at uh, uh, film on. You can call us at three ten two nine nine zero six six six. Excuse me. In the UK, the fabulous United Kingdom, you can go to zero two zero three five eight two eight nine one four. Skype us at Film On Live. You know, today, April, there's so much going on in the community. There's a buzz in Hollywood. You know, I mean, all those glamour dresses are coming in. Oh my God, I love the glamour. You know, dresses. Uh, you know the poofy poofy gowns from all the most fashionable designers in the world. And you know, this year we have Jennifer Lawrence. She's up for that fantastic. Probably her second Academy Award. Uh, she is up for uh, uh, American Hustle, you know, the uh, film with Christian Bale and Jennifer, Jennifer, Jeremy Renner and Bradley Cooper. He's so hot. I, I always had the hots for him in big time. Bradley Cooper's hot, but Jennifer Lawrence is just amazing. Like, she I is, think isn't she's she? so fantastic. She's great. Now, who of the famous actresses, the, the Academy Award winning actresses that you've helped get ready for the red carpet, uh, you know, for the, for, the, for the, I mean, this is the Academy Awards. Who is one of your favorite actresses uh, that, you, that you've come in contact with? Is it with? weird that I say Meryl Streep? I just Why? admire her and I look up to her. Well, Why? you know, she's like an older actress, but I just think she's so amazing and like Devil Wears Prada. And yeah. this year she's in the film with Julia Roberts, uh, uh, Usage County, where Jamero Streep, you know, I, I, I don't know, she's won so many Academy Awards. You know, the, she's, be, she's, she's, uh, she's like not to be uh, compared with Dame Judi Dench, but you know, she gets those awards and uh, the Golden Globes also really, really like her, you know. Have you ever met Meryl? Uh, I have not met Meryl, but I have, I have met Julia Roberts several occasions. She's lovely. In fact, I was up for the part of Pretty Woman. Oh, no way. Yeah, you know, I but I, it. I sabotaged it because I didn't want to, you know. I wore the wrong thing for the uh, audition, and it was really embarrassing. I came in wearing these hot, hot pants, and I don't think I had uh, properly bikini waxed. And it, the whole thing, you know, it, did, it, did, it didn't work out, you know. But I did want to be involved in those hot sex scenes with G uh, Oh Richard Gere. Richard Gere. Richard Gere rocks. Also, uh, there's so many people uh, getting Academy Award nods, you know. Uh, Forrest Whitaker for The Butler. And even Will You Be Dressing, the fabulous Oprah Winfrey. Oh my God. I've never been able to dress Oprah, but it is my dream. You know, boring people by talking about current events here in Hollywood. You know, we're, we're putting together a show, April, uh, for Battle Cam viewers. It'll be out like when I get back from China. Uh, <laughs> we're going to have uh, the Have Faith Swimwear uh, competition where we're looking for the Have Faith Swimwear Model of the Year contest. You know, uh, Jennifer Stanos, she's a designer of uh, extraordinaire, and her bikinis knock people out. I mean, when I put that bikini on, I am hot. Philmont's going to do this? We are doing this, uh, and we're, we're, we're putting together a, a panel right now as we speak. The great Alki David, Omar of all Omar, who's the genius in back of Philmont, has approved of this fantastic idea. We're going to be having model anyone that wants to sign up for the model competition you can get in touch with us you can call in and or submit your resumes right now at 342 North Cannon okay just submit those resumes and it uh, we're oh my god it's gonna be a lot of sexy bodies changing into bikinis it will be how the model walks in the bikini how the bikini fits the model and if she really is going to get billboards on Sunset Boulevard she's going to be getting she's going to be getting a cash prize and she's going to be able to walk in the have faith swimwear uh, competition that, that'll be held in Miami in February I'm really excited to oh see my god it's battle so cameras awesome. need sex we all need sex Kavako is right for swimwear model you know we'll even take we'll even take uh, applications from men if you've got what it takes to be a swimwear model men you can get in touch with us at 342 North Cannon submit your resumes now and uh, you can get in touch with David Nussbaum here at the studios, and you can uh, send in your resumes. It's going to be so exciting. Shake those bums and abs. You know, when I was a judge on America's Next Top Model, working alongside Tyra Banks, 
uh, the two fake J's that never did really anything in the oh. fashion industry. Uh, no, correct. Uh, you know. Now he, we know. He, he, forget it. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna. They were very stingy with me about money, but I do have a following of people that remember me from America's Next Top Model and remember all of the phenomenal things, uh, work that I've done in the UK. And it's always a, an extraordinary moment, you know, to uh, show the work that I've done. You know, I used to watch that show in high school. Oh, great. That love, dates me. I seeing you on it and your uh, modeling agency That really show. dates me. We've got, uh, <laughs> we've got things to talk about today. How about Mike Tyson? Banned from Brit ban is banned from Britain over a conviction. He had plans to go to Britain on his book tour to promote his new book, but border officials basically told him to f off because he is a convicted from 1992. They don't like running around. Yeah, I believe the girl that he name was Desiree Washington. Poor Desiree. I wonder yeah, it was a long time uh, ago. You know. If her has, has recovered, Probably but not. the former heavyweight champion is banned from promoting his autobiography called An Undisputed Truth. I wonder what that's about. Well, you know, about not committing the. You know, I mean, think about these guys, these, these basketball players, you know, that make millions of dollars a year. You know, they get a little high, you know, they think they can stick their, everyone thinks they can stick their athletic, huge African American in like little tight, you know, five foot something, um, you know, backup dancing models and it hurts you know to at least try try the KY jelly that's my recommendation I mean yeah I guess if you're going to someone you might as well at least be polite about it I agree what about you know uh, have you ever been no I've not been have you been I have been and I didn't like it it was uh, from Bill Cosby back in the day Bill Cosby uh, threw me down and against my will plunged it and uh, I still have uh, post-traumatic stress over the situation and every time you know I hear uh, you know the Cosby's you know promoting anything on television I shudder had to have a lot of therapy about that I'm oh, sorry to hear about that Janet. yeah I know but I, I we we do recover because I will survive you're a strong woman I am a strong woman I am Jim Dickinson here